How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to be showing you how you can pass or protect your external drive such as your SSD, HDD, pen drive, microSD and more. Now before you show you the main and further process, there are two things you have to be very, very careful with. First up, the every single file or data and content you might have in your external drive will be removed. Therefore, you can take a backup every single file that you might have right on your MacBook Pro. Now after you have just taken a backup of your file, now let's go ahead and do the process. Now to do the process, the first place you want to go is your Spotlight Search and now type Disk Utility and now click on Disk Utility. Once this opens up, now click on this arrow icon and click Show All Devices. Now make sure to choose your external drive which is right here. Click on the first external USB-C, not this other one, go ahead and choose this one and now click on Erase. Now let's go ahead and talk about the first things from here, okay? Now you can change your name of course, so let me change the name first. Especially for the pen drive and other devices, you have to be careful with this scheme, okay? Click on there and make sure you're choosing this guide partition map, okay? Now once you've chosen this option, now let's go ahead and talk about your format. Now, APFS, which is basically for Apple File System, this format will only give you the access to use your external drive with your Mac. However, the format called FEFS will not give you the access to use the external drive with the Windows. Now, once you just agree, now click on the FEFS the Apple file system encrypted, now enter your password and verify it and then enter your password hint. Now once you've entered your password, verified and after entering the password hint, click on choose and click erase. Now once your process is done, click on done and now you're all set. Now the thing is, each time you eject your external drive from your Mac and place it back on and then it's going to ask you the password to give you the access. Now go ahead and enter your password and after you click on unlock and now it's going to give you the access of your external drive and now you're full free you can you know copy or just transfer anything you want your every single file such as your pictures videos and more will be password protected on your mac all right guys so if you find this video useful if so leave a like and subscribe to the channel and tell us about your opinion in the comment section thanks for watching and i'll talk to you later